Hello YouTube, it's Ernesto Rivera. I'm back again, this time with the third video update on the Tier 4 Jeevos. This is the Union Pacific uh, version right here, and the Norfolk Southern. Uh, remember before I was having problems with the Norfolk Southern, um, you know, with the, with the shell and the main headlight not working in the dish light. Well, we figured out the problem, and you see this... So it looks like a black gasket. It's a plastic gasket that sits over the, the, the LED board right here. It's noticeably missing right here on the Norfolk Southern version. Alright? But the Union Pacific version has it because it's supposed to be mounted to the board so this way it shines through the top of the roof of the cab. Now I'll show you the shell and you can see on the inside there's the gasket it's right there on the inside and there's a piece of foam it looks like that is glued to so I'm gonna pull that out and I'm gonna put it back you can see there's two little I guess there's two little pins right here right down there and that's what's blocking the light to get into the cab. You can't see it from the outside, but uh, right there. And those, you will see that there's two little notches right there in front, right here. Right in there. See those two little holes? And that's where that gasket goes right into. It's like a little plastic uh, gasket, like spacer, and it shines, lets the light shine through, just like this. And that's what it should look like. So I'm gonna quickly do that and fix that. It seems like for some reason, uh, moving on, that the Union Pacific has fixed itself. I don't know what's going on, but I took the shell off this one just to see if there was any wiring issue with the, you know, so here's the front headlight, and then I, as soon as I hit the direction from the rear, now it comes on, and then I can turn it off now. I mean, it's it doesn't make sense. So I'll keep playing around with the Union Pacific version. I didn't do any reset. I just took it apart just to see what was going on. But so far, that one it seems to be working okay. These are the number board lights right here, and they should turn off when I shut on the engine. Okay. Give you a better look at the gasket. It's a plastic, uh, it's a plastic gasket that's supposed to let the light project through, but that's you could clearly see it's not here. So I'm gonna put that back on, and um, I'm gonna run a video after this so we can get the Norfolk Southern. I'm still waiting for my replacement one to come in, so I'll keep you updated on that. And so next, until next time, guys, I'll see you later.